Next up on WTV, the FISD Virtual Job Fair, the Find Your Future Night, and a Red Rhythm Auction. WTV's daily update starts now. Hey there, Red Hawk Nation. Today is Wednesday, September 14th, and I'm Hannah Beeler with today's daily update brought to you by Wingspan TV. College Week is in full swing, which means that this year's college fair is coming up. WTV's Karina Goreska has the story. Juniors and seniors have the opportunity to visit with more than a dozen colleges without leaving the area, as FISD is holding a virtual college fair. This year, the virtual college fair will be hosted by the Texas Association of College Registration and Admissions Office. Once students register and create an account, they will be able to chat with college representatives, browse colleges, and visit virtual college booths. In addition, starting this Friday through November 29th, students are able to talk to college representatives. During registration, students will be matched with their interests and college attributes they are looking for. Students can register for the fair using the QR code below. Reporting for WTV, I'm Karina Groska. Juniors and seniors will be able to talk to representatives from colleges and other organizations at tonight's Find Your Future Night. WTV's Nishil Gamadi has the details. Representatives from many colleges and organizations will be at different campuses throughout the district to provide students and their parents with information about their schools. It's a good chance for seniors to talk to college reps as they start to go through the college application process. Talking to different college representatives will help me better understand the morals and values of colleges and will help me figure out a place where I'll feel at home and supported and I'll just enjoy my four years and further my college experience. Going to college night is going to be really helpful because being able to talk to different representatives from colleges makes it a lot easier to help understand where will be the best spot for me and what major or minor will be the most helpful for my education. Tonight's event is at Wakeland High School from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. for private and selective schools and at Centennial High School from 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. for the Big Ten schools. Reporting for WTV, I am Nishal Gumadi. Red Rhythm held their mini clinic earlier this month, and now they're having an event that combines the mini clinic and homecoming game. WTV's Varun Saravanan has the details. Alongside their performances and competitions, Red Rhythm often hosts mini clinics for young dancers in the community. The team is holding a silent auction for the dancers who registered for the mini clinic. That will be live through Friday. I think it's a fun experience for the little girls to be able to sit with officers at games so they could really experience what it's like to be on Red Rhythm, especially doing stand dances and victory lines with us. The auction gives clinic participants the chance to be able to sit next to a Red Rhythm officer during the first quarter and half of the second quarter of the homecoming game this weekend. Reporting for WTV, I'm Varun Saravanan. If you're looking for more from Wingspan, you can follow us at Liberty Wingspan on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok, or visit our award-winning website, libertywingspan.com. And now for today's announcements. There's an academic decathlon interest meeting in C202 during advisory today. ACDEC is a 10-event quiz competition. The team consists of nine students from three different GPA levels. We are especially looking for students who have made some Bs and Cs in the last two school years. If you're interested, come in to learn more. Key Club will be having its first meeting during advisory this Thursday in the auditorium. Join the Key Club Remind at Key Club 300 for more information. Black Student Union will be having a meeting today in room C-154. This will be an introductory meeting describing the club's purpose and officer positions. All students are welcome. Do you care about climate change? Do you want to do more for the earth? The Students for Environmental Action Club will be having its first meeting of the school year today during advisory in Ms. Brent's room, C-241. Use the QR code below to join the remind or text at LibSEA22 to 81010. Foundation for International Medical Relief of Children is a club dedicated to helping medically underserved communities around the world and giving students the opportunity to think of healthcare on a more global scale. The first meeting will be today during advisory in Mr. Doty's room, C145. Homecoming Spirit Week has begun and the homecoming game is Friday. Students can be in their class colors and wear their mums and garters both to school and the game. The dance is Saturday and tickets can be purchased now at onlineschoolfees.com for $25 or at the door for $30. Order your yearbook for the lowest price of the year until September 16th. Get four icons for free if you purchase a personalized book. The Legacy staff is holding an event for students and staff members to have their drawings included in the yearbook. Draw a doodle of your iconic self with your name and post it on the submission posters that are found around the school. Or post it on your story and tag the yearbook account for a chance to get a discount on your yearbook. The event ends on September 16th and participants must buy their yearbooks by then to be eligible for the raffle. 
For more questions, contact Coach Parkman or visit at lhs.legacyyearbook. That's it for today's daily update. This is Hannah Bueller for Wingspan TV.